Before we go into the roles and responsibilities, let's review what we mean by case report form. According to ISO 14155, a case report form, or CRF, is defined as a set of printed, paper, or electronic documents designed to record all information necessary about a subject that has been enrolled in the clinical investigation. What information is to be recorded is dictated by the requirements of the clinical investigation plan. Now, there are specific rules for completing case report forms, and we will review some of the essential ones here. The investigator can delegate the completion of case report forms to another physician, study coordinator, nurse, or assistant, only if these authorized designees have been trained properly on the process and if they have the necessary clinical qualifications. Only the principal investigator or his or her authorized designee with qualifications equal to the principal investigator can sign off on the case report forms, whether paper or electronic signature. Before signing, the accuracy of the data needs to be verified, especially when the investigator delegates parts of the completion of the case report forms. As a monitor, it is important to identify the authorized signatures against the site personnel log identifying signatures and authorized functions within the clinical investigation. You will occasionally see new signatures pop up without being notified as new personnel gets involved. Make sure all authorized personnel are identified on a log, including their signatures, initials, authorized designated tasks, and the period covered for these responsibilities.